I'm in a busy city centre. I've been shopping, I'm tired, and it's time to phone a friend. Luckily, I have my mobile phone with me, and like me, it's switched on and raring to go. I have my phone firmly in my right hand, and then select the digit of choice, in my case, the left index finger. Place your finger on the button. Don't come at it from a distance. As I press the buttons, so the number appears in the display. I'm happy with that number. Remember, check twice and phone once. Let's hope he's in. I now press the green button on my phone, which activates the call. Hi, John. It's Dave. Any chance of a lift? Well, let's hope John's on his way. But I've got time to put in an in case of emergency number into my phone. I've chosen Sarah. What I need to do, first of all, is to find the menu button on my phone. And there it is. Press the menu and search for contacts. Select contacts and find the button that says add contacts. At this point, I'm prompted to put in Sarah's name. Each button on the keypad has some letters assigned to it. The position of those letters tells me how many times I have to press the button to enter that letter. Now I'm prompted to put in the number. OK. I can now use this number and that is now saved and I can contact Sarah at the press of a button. And here's John now. Hi John, how thank you. you. Well, I'm going to send Sarah a message now, a text message, to let her know we're on our way. So, first of all, I go to the menu button on my phone, and up comes the word messages. I go to create message. At this point, I can key in the message. On our way, I'm ready to send. I press the send button. So Sarah's got her message, and that's how to use a mobile phone. Let's go, John.